Hello and welcome back to free Excel tutorial videos. Um, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can perform the what if analysis in Excel. Um, we want to be able to change two variables in a formula at the same time. Okay, so let's take a look at the, the spreadsheet that I have here. Over here in cell B8, I have the uh, net price. Okay, this uh, inside this cell, I have a formula, and uh, which uh, has, has given me the net price. Okay, the formula is the price multi multiply by the quantity and multiply by the discount. Okay. So the discount I have masked it inside a, a a bracket of one minus the B5. So I am paying ninety percent. Okay. So um, say that I want to see what are the quantity and the price, and instead of going here you know, and change this amount and change this amount. Um, one value at a time um, things can be much easier if we can set up a data table okay so notice here I have already set up a data table um, I have here running across is the uh, variable inputs and this is the price running across I can I can change uh, the price to $75, $100, $125 and so on okay and then there is the quantity running down here okay 5 to 105 okay so what uh, in this data table it's going to what it's going to do is it's going to substitute this number say this number over here is going to substitute this number and this number over here will be substituted by this number and that will give me the, the amount that I'm going to um, be paying okay the 90% that I'm going to, be going to be paying so um, let's use the what if analysis okay let's begin at the anchor cell okay this is the anchor cell the cell that contains the formula now we select the inputs running across okay and also the input running downwards okay doing this we will be selecting all the empty cells as well okay um, so now let's go to the data tab and the data tool sets data tool options we have the what if analysis so we're going to click click on the arrow and we we will select the data table okay so my row labels are the price okay uh, and in the formula the price is in cell B3 okay so let's come up here so the row input cell is the price so we want to be changing this amount over here so it's going to be cell B3 and the column input cell is going to be the quantity okay so it's going to be this amount over here so what it does is it's going to it's going to change from this 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 number and then for the quantity is going to be changing throughout for the whole number running down okay so when I click OK I will get the data table so are you ready okay let's click OK so there you go okay we have uh, the data table generated for us so here are the results okay now if you click inside the data table you will be able to see the formula okay this means I won't be able to change any information inside the array okay I will get an error okay. 
okay so um, for this um, if if the price was 100 and the quantity was 25 I will have to pay 90% which is 2250 okay so let's see okay we have a quantity 50 and 50 price is 50 quantity is 50 so this price here is the price that we are paying so we can see um, exactly uh, what amount and what quantity and the amount of the, the net price that we can get okay so I mentioned earlier that you cannot change this because it's an array formula so say if you want to change the table you have to delete the entire array okay so you have to go select everything and delete okay so that is how you can use um, the what if analysis tool Excel f to generate a data table um, so that you can see um, what a price you can compare prices and quantity in order to, for you to get net price okay so that's it for this video I will see you in the next video